are the steps to take for light vacuuming. Choose a 12 to 15 inch or 30 by 38 centimeter vacuum for offices and congested area. Use wider vacuums for wide open spaces. Check that the bag is no more than half filled and if necessary, change bag and inspect filters to see if they also need to be replaced. Do not attempt to use a vacuum with a damaged cord, power switch, or machine that has been locked out or tagged as out of service. Uncoil the cord and plug the vacuum into a receptacle that allows for cleaning as large an area as possible without having to move the plug to another receptacle. Vacuum the carpet using as much of a walking motion and as little arm movement as possible. Walk with the vacuum. Pay special attention to the high traffic areas and cover each of these areas with one to three passes. When all areas are completed, return the vacuum to the specified storage area. Wipe the outside of the machine with a clean damp cloth and store in the appropriate area. Depending on the traffic level, a scheduled detail vacuum will be required. A detailed vacuuming has similar procedures, but with a few key changes. For a detailed vacuuming, it is best to use an agitation bar to improve the soil removal. Move over each area three to five times and vacuum according to maintenance schedule. For help with your floor care program, contact a wood wine expert. We can be reached at 1-800-361-7691 or info at woodwine.com.